I'm Jennifer Angel, these are your stars, Taurus. Now there's a lot of activity happening around your family, so in your fourth solar house, your family zone and uh, the area of your home. Um, so domestic matters are likely to come up under the microscope and also it can be people that you consider close enough to be family as well, so keep that in mind. Now although there are some very pleasant things happening around you this week, you do want to keep in mind that in the around the home and uh, family area that Mercury comes into that zone on the 8th, so early in this week, and it is a retrograde, so this is more to the point. So you you want to just watch what you say and how you say it, how you approach somebody is going to be very important. So be strategic, sit down. If you have a conversation that's of a sensitive matter that you need to say to clear the air with somebody, sit down first and plan it out. Work it as a meeting. So what you don't want to do over this time is be reactive. Now the other significant thing happening in your solar chart is there's a full moon in your solar 10th house, which is your house of career and business. Now this can be changes that are sudden or just things that happen around your work which gives you the motivation to do it differently, move forward and um, you know a full moon is really about endings and beginnings so you can close something off and this can be the way that you deal with a situation or issue or things to do with your work and career life. It may just be, be that you'll get a, a greater perspective on what's happening and how you can move forward. So in that sense it's a very positive time. Have a great week Taurus. I'm Jennifer Angel. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week.